Welcome to TYT Sports, Francis Maxwell bringing you the concluding coverage from Group F, Bosnia-Herzegovina against Iran. So a game that Bosnia uh, didn't need to wait, uh, sorry, nothing would matter in their qualification stages as they crashed out of the competition already. Iran, however, needed a win and hoping that Nigeria lost in order to try, uh, attempt to qualify into the last 16. Uh, Nigeria, uh, unfortunately for Iran, did lose in their game but they couldn't deliver on the other end as Bosnia defeated them 3-1. Bosnia came out of this game searching for their first ever World Cup win as this was their first ever time in the tournament and they got it so they left with a bit of pride and it fair play to them. Aidan Dzeko scored to get the, the game underway in the 23rd minute um, and his goal this time hopefully not ruled offside uh, due to possibly a uh, bad refereeing in the last game but um, this would add to his confidence no doubt uh, the Bosnian striker and then uh, the, the scoring continued as Iran were pushing forward to try and get a goal but Bosnia were ruthless on the counter attack as Marilyn Bajani who plays for uh, Roma added to, hit, added to the score and made it 2-0 but Iran were not going to go down without fighting as they have done in this competition fair play to them um, they managed to put up a fight throughout the competition, obviously against Argentina in particular. But once again, they were hit on the, the counter-attack. They brought it back to 2-1, but then Bosnia would finish off the scoring and make it 3-1 uh, to, to grasp their, their first World Cup victory. So fair play to them. Again, I, it takes a lot for a player and a team to come back after, after losing and putting out the competition. As I said with Spain, um, I, I, th I really respect the team that although they're out of the, the, the World Cup already, they could easily lay down and not give their, their travelling fans something to about but Bosnia I will credit to them as they have done in this competition and um, they've gave their home nation something to be proud of uh, as well as Iran uh, no doubt that they, they definitely have shown that they're not mugs in this group it was a close call uh, Bosnia and Iran will take our Turks of this competition uh, a lot of play, uh, people may have ruled them out um, but they definitely showed that they are they're worthy of their place in this competition so both of them get our Turks Eden Dzeko in particular uh, a big fan of him as a player and I think that he'll go on to do even better things in club and you never know in the future a lot of tweets coming out from Bosnia saying they'll be ready for Russia this is only their first try at it um, so I mean they left with a victory, that's all that really mattered to their fans after this. And Iran unfortunately crashed out at the bottom of this group. Uh, stay tuned for more action, plenty of more games coming your way. Uh, obviously follow us on uh, Twitter at TYT Sports, follow me at Twitter at Francis underscore Maxwell. If you like the way I'm looking, then uh, I mean some people don't, some people do, but um, just that little extra, extra bit of time to prepare, make sure to follow my fashion blog at Preparation Fashion. Um, uh, the link should be coming up on your screen and make sure to tune in to TYT Sports.